Say what you want, I get what you need. You stay on mine, you're not fooling me. Don't pay on my mind. And we're gonna be talking about Ali A. Ali motherfucking A. Jesus Christ, how the mighty have fallen. And you know what? I used to like this guy. And I did do a video talking about how Fortnite YouTubers need to stop. You could kind of say this is like the third and final one that I'm doing. I was kind of talking about best trends and I mentioned Ali A briefly. I really wanted to be careful talking about Ali A, but no. Ali A has got even worse. And let me tell you one thing. I actually don't mind him as a person. I think he's a decent person, but the content. Let's just say Ali A is a meme right now. All right, guys, who is ready? What is going to happen? But you take away the meme and you look at the actual content and it's fucking trash. I'm sorry, but how can anybody sit down and watch this guy's content for real? He's a fucking terrible YouTuber right now. To be honest with you, Fortnite, I like the game, but the community, the YouTubers, they ruin it for everybody. Fake news, stealing and ripping content off the Twitch streamers like Ninja and all of them other people. I don't really know these streamers, but Ali A. It's just a whole new breed of shit. I think he's probably one of the main problems with Fortnite because like you type in Fortnite and then obviously like if you're watching someone like Ninja, Lachlan or anyone else like Ali A and his fucking over exaggerated face in the thumbnail is going to appear in your recommended and you might not even like watch Ali A but Ali A will still always appear in your recommended because he's the number one Fortnite YouTuber view wise not quality wise because the quality of his content is absolutely fucking shit. Now, a lot of these Fortnite YouTubers are responsible for making fake videos. So what do I mean by this? Now, Ali A, why do you need to do this? Like, the Wonder Woman challenge in Fortnite. Like, look at the thumbnail. You might be thinking, shit, is Wonder Woman in Fortnite? He's done this with Iron Man, he's done this with Hulk, he's done this with Spider-Man, any superhero, which is Marvel or DC, he's pretty much done. You can pretty much, like, picture these superheroes and shit. But they're not in there. It's just a skin which looks like Wonder Woman, which looks like Spider-Man. He'll basically say it for like three minutes. Oh, this is the skin. We could be seeing this skin. And if you look closely on the fucking thumbnail, it says not real. Yeah, like they're definitely going to see that. They're going to think shit. Is Wonder Woman in the game? No, she's not in the game. Let me just save you the time and energy. And also what I don't get, why the fuck is the video like 24 minutes long? Why does it need to be that long? It doesn't have to be that long. I'll tell you why, because Ali A thought to himself, you know what, since I can't really make a three minute video doing fake news, I have to get some ad revenue. I have to leech off my subscribers. I need some money, even though I've got like 13 million subscribers. I need more money. So I'm just gonna trick them into a Superman, a Wonder Woman skin and all of this shit. And uh, I'll do like a live commentary for 20 minutes and you know, then we're really balling with the money. Let's be honest, Ali A, who actually fucking plays Fortnite like Ali A? I mean, the way how his reactions go, the way how he's playing it, the things that he says, it's like, okay, maybe a kid would say that, but like, you're telling me a normal fucking person would do that. Like, that's just cringy, man. Like, that's just cringe. Whoa! 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 Where's my crosshead? Jeez! Uh, oh, you're crazy! I think the video that really stands out for me for Ali A, the one video that is this. This made Ali A delete Fortnite Battle Royale. What's the point? What's the point? You know, he's gonna reinstall the fucking game, so what's the point in that? I really don't see the point, Ali. What's the point in just like making reactions like this? then deleting the game and then you go back to making fucking clickbait fortnite videos anyway i mean look ali a was bad with the clickbait on call of duty he was cringy at times he did suck the activision cock at times but with fortnite he's got even worse and somehow he's getting millions and millions and millions of views the arrows in the thumbnail the clickbait titles it reaches over the 10 minute mark hell it even reaches the 20 minute mark are we getting 20 minute ad revenue not 10 minute That's ad crazy revenue? man on youtube but yeah this guy gets into your recommended and he won't stop the guy won't stop because ali ain't gonna listen any and like the thing is the best thing about this people are just memeing the guy to shit i mean he deserves to get memed the intros like he'll just do some crazy thing in the game and then he'll just have that intro and then you've seen the meme i don't really need to tell you about the memes let me just say some of them are out of control some of the memes which i've seen oh my god they make me crease they're so fucking funny man i think this has been a long time coming for ali a because ali a is pretty much the laughing stock he was the laughing stock 
of the COD community. No one really liked him then. Now he's the laughing stock of the Fortnite community because basically the guy will go on Reddit, see some news, like some leaked things, it will not even leaked things, like people are suggesting skins. He'll go onto the subreddit, he'll have a look at it on his phone or his computer and think, hmm, I can make that into an easy three minute video. Fuck that. I'll do a live commentary and then, you know, I'll just talk about how I had a wank the other day. Yeah, for 20 minutes long. Loads of money. I could pay the mortgage off. I could pay the bills and boom, I've got all that money. And yet gullible kids will go on and view the video and be like, oh, Ali A's best YouTuber ever. As I said before, I don't have a problem with the person. Like, I think he's a good guy. He's a nice guy. I just think it's the content which he makes. Like, it's shit. Let's be honest. It's been shit for quite a few years. I used to watch him for Call of Duty and I used to enjoy his content and watch it pretty much every day. But now, when I see Ali A, I just think I'm another cringy thing in Fortnite. Look at his face in the thumbnail. He's probably going to do some cringy ass dancing, which I'm not even going to basically tell you about because the dancing was just, oh my God. It was something else. It's something else. And you lot have seen it. So I'm going to save you your energy and save you the time so you don't have to see it. But will he ever stop? Will the clickbait get worse? Probably will. But that is it for the video. My name is Blacks TV. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new. Turn on notifications if you're a new subscriber. So you never miss an upload. Follow me on Twitter as well. Link is down below in the description. And if you want me to talk about any other YouTuber, DM it to me on Twitter. Suggest it to me in the comment section. So, you know, if there's a good idea and a good suggestion, then I'll shout you out and I'll probably do a video on it. So that is it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to leave a like, as I said before. My name is Blacks TV. Have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next one. No local man who's in charge. The man don't ball like they in charge. I kick ball like I'm Lingard. I got 99 problems. None of them are goals. You got 99 girls. But they all call you bro. See how my bars and you're like it. Cause like man, I'm united. Yeah, I'm far from my peak. Getting stronger. Getting paid every week like I'm